This is Veda, and this is not an interview with Manny Supreme. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go get some hair. Mm-hmm. Synthetic. <laughs> Thank you for sitting down with us today. Thank you. That's your favorite beauty supply. Yeah, this is my favorite. Uh, Granny literally lived right, right down the street. Right. This is like the go-to when I'm over here. What is your favorite verse you ever wrote? Wait, no, this is really a loaded question. I got to really think. Hold on. One that when you it's... hear it, you like. I was talking some shit for real. I like ASAP. I was really talking some shit and it was really angry and I could feel all the emotion. And then I heard ASAP by T.I. and I was like, I ain't seen nobody flip this yet. So I was like, hurry up, made the beat. Like I started it off like, I'm a jealous ass bitch and I don't give a shit and I need money now and it is what it is. You do come from a background of producing, right? So mm -hmm. if you could make a song and you could only choose three instruments to use on that song, what three instruments would you choose? 808, snare, hi-hat. You should make a song like that for fun. Yeah, I that think would, we should for the summertime. That would be fun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, are you a breakfast or dinner type of person? Dinner. Favorite meal? Mine is spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Um, I was going to say crab legs, but I had some crab legs recently, and it was like too much work. Yeah, it was like all you can eat crab legs, and it was just too much work. I'm not going to give them no free promo because they were tiny, but like <laughs> it was too much work. I feel like my favorite meal, it's like a pasta or something. You remember making your first beat? One of my friends gave me a flash drive with FL on it mm -hmm. and stuff, so I got home and I was like, let me try it out. I sampled Amy Winehouse. It's called R.I.P. Amy. Uh, I still have the beat. Now, the Breeze tape is one of my favorites from the cover art. It's just like, yeah. I have to listen to this. <laughs> you feel me? Uh, now, Bingo, of course, shout out to your performance and everybody at LVRN. Shout you with the now. live band? I love that. I always yeah, wanted to okay. do some shit like that. That's when Mama first time seeing me perform. Really? Ever. Yeah. When you performed Bingo, I was like, when, do you remember recording it? Yeah, I was at my friend Hundo House. He had Wave, the producer, pull mm -hmm. up. I think Bingo was the first time song I ever did like that night. And then I did Topic right after that. I feel like those are like some good ass songs. Did you write a freestyle? I always freestyle. I'm just starting to write. Take me back to the day that you started rapping. You said that you went and bought a USB mic. Mm -hmm. I want you to walk us through that. It was like pandemic time. So I went bought a USB mic like on Amazon type shit. Came in. Amazon Prime? No. It took two weeks. Yeah, it took two weeks. Okay. Yeah. Duh. I was like, I need something to do. When I was a kid, I wanted to like be dancing and singing on stage. So I was like, let me do that. If you could build your dream song, put two of your dream features on it, who would you put on there? Raphael Sadiq. I love him. He's a really good songwriter, like Tony, Tony, Tony. I would put him on vocals. He's a really good producer, though, too. And I'd probably get like Stevie Wonder to like... <sighs> Like, I feel like it would be too smooth, though. I don't know. I think Raphael Sadiq and Stevie Wonder put them together. You got to make that happen. I know y'all going to see this. Being from the east side, mm -hmm. you graduated top 10% of your class. Yeah. From Stevenson High School. Stevenson. Shout out the Jaguars. Shout out to the Jaguars. <laughs> I had a lot of friends that went to Arabia. Yeah. What can you say was your favorite high school memory? Most memorable. Senior year, because I had finished all my classes early. I only had half days the whole senior year. So, like, I would be able to go outside and do whatever the hell I wanted to do. And my parents right were super around, strict. Because the they didn't I know was. your schedule. They didn't know my schedule yeah i think senior year shout out to you for getting it done early <laughs> <laughs>